In the last video, that should be part 7, we stopped in question 15 and I told you that in, in, part, in part 8, we will continue from where we stopped. Question number 15. This is authentic real biology questions direct from JAM, right? So I need you to pay real attention. Anything distracting you now is your enemy. You are preparing for this exam. I need you to pay great attention. What is the function of the white blood cell? What is the function of the white blood cell? A. Transporting oxygen. B. Fighting infection. C. Carrying nutrients. D. Clotting blood. The answer is fighting infections. Your white blood cell, which we call leukemia, uh, I think the leukemia, right? I think it should be something like that. Leukocytes, yes, leukocytes. The leukocytes are responsible for doing what? Fighting diseases and germs that try to invade our systems. Okay? Then we have the ones we call thrombocytes. Red blood cell. Then we have the one we call erythrocytes. Okay? Then we have all, all these blood vessels, blood cells have their different functions. Okay? That's why I need you to read harder make some research like difference between veins difference between veins and arteries one carries blood uh, into the heart and one carries blood away from the heart one carries oxygenated blood the other carries the oxygenated blood these are things i need you to find out make your personal research i could just explain everything to you but then i will not be there with you in the example and jam sometimes to with the question and there are different parts somebody can be writing biology type a another person can be writing type d another person will be writing type c you see the questions will vary even if you see the question ahead of time which is also not possible but assuming you were to see jam question ahead of time it may not be your own type when you enter the hall what is the purpose of the circulatory system? What is the purpose of the circulatory system? A. Transportation of gases, nutrients, and waste products. B. Maintaining body temperature. C. Regulating hormones. D. Providing structural support. Transportation of gases, nutrients, and waste products. What is the purpose of circulatory system? The answer is A. Transportation of gases, nutrients, and waste products. Circulatory system, that is the blood and the veins, the heart, and all the rest. Basically for transport, transport, moving things, circulating things around your body. Have you ever asked yourself, you have headache in your head. Then when you want to take paracetamol, you take it inside your stomach. And very soon, the head will stop, the egg will stop in your head. How does the paracetamol move from your stomach to your head? It is circulation circulation okay what is the role of dna in cells what is the feeling of dna assignment number one tell me in the comment section assignment number one what the full meaning of dna is what is the role of dna in cells a providing energy b storing genetic information c breaking down waste d regulating blood Regulating cell growth. What is the role of DNA in cells? A. Providing energy. B. Storing genetic information. C. Breaking down waste. D. Regulating cells growth. The answer is simple. The answer is storing genetic information. Your DNA. I wanted to tell you the full meaning now, but I won't tell you. I want you to give me the full meaning in the comment section. Okay. DNA is what? Responsible for storing genetic information remember that what you are watching is part eight we have done part one two three four five six and you are now in part eight of our series on biology after biology we have done a lot of videos on chemistry physics use of english the jam novel government economics literature all of them we have done videos on them any of them you need me to give you access to if you need me to give you the access to all the videos we've done on use of english or the jam novel or uh, you need me to give you access to all the videos we've done on here on biology physics chemistry just tell me sir please give me access to all the videos you have done and you now mention the name of the subject 
I could give them to you so that you can begin from part one to watch over and over again. And if I were you, I will not just watch once. I will keep watching. Remember, what you are watching is not a Nollywood film. You are actually preparing yourself, getting yourself ready for this all-important jump exam. Which of the following is not a function of the immune system? A. Fighting infection. B. Regulating body temperature. C. Removing damaged cells. D. Producing hormones. The immune system doesn't produce hormones. They fight infections, basically, and few other functions. What is the purpose of the endocrine, endocrine system? What is the purpose of the endocrine system? A. Controlling movement. B. Regulating metabolism, growth and development. C. Excreting waste. D. Digesting food. The endocrine system regulates metabolism, growth and development. Okay? Which of the following is not a component of blood? Which is not a component of blood? A. Platelets. B. Plasma. C. Hormones. D. Bone marrow. Bone marrow is not a component of blood. Even though the blood is produced in the bone marrow. Okay, but bone marrow is not is not found inside the blood. But inside the blood, you can see the blood platelets. Platelets are basically uh, for blood clotting. Like if you have a wound or a scratch in your body, before you know it, the place will begin to be clotted. I mean to be to be filled up, to, to be covered up by your blood. It's done by the platelets. Now we have blood plasma, hormones, and all the rest. Okay? Let's move on. I hope you are still following. I hope you are still following. What is the process by what is the process by which plants release water vapor into the atmosphere? The process by which plants release water vapor into the atmosphere is it transpiration, respiration, photosynthesis, germination? Whenever it comes to plants releasing water to the atmosphere, right? It is called transpiration. Transpiration. The process as the sun is shining, that sun is getting drying water from plants, their leaves and their back. That process is called transpiration. Say it. Transpiration. Transpiration. You know why I am doing this? I am doing these videos and I keep dropping videos for you because I am serious about you getting admission. I hope I'm not more serious than you are about your jam. I hope I am not, I know the carry on for her more than even you that is writing the exam. <laughs> so I keep dropping videos because I want you to gain admission this year. Not only gain admission, you will enter university this year. Not only entering university this year, you will be among the few or those that will be proud of your jam result. Whenever they ask you how much did you score, how many did you score, you'll be proud to say how many you scored. You will enter school this year. You will be one of those that could will invite me to their matric, right? Nothing will stop you. I want you to claim it. And you will score 300 and above. There is no two ways about it. A no member of this YouTube channel, Noble Tutorials, will score 130, 170. No, 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 no. We'll reject it even on your head. We'll reject it on your behalf. We'll reject uh, uh, staying one year at home again. Why your colleagues will enter school? It is not your portion. I want you to claim it. Then let's keep working hard. Which of the following is not a characteristic of, of living organisms? Which is not a characteristic of living organisms? A. Growth and development. B. Response to stimuli. C. Ability to reproduce. D. Inorganic composition. Which of the following is not a characteristic of living things? Growth and development. B. Respond to stimuli. C. Ability to reproduce D, inorganic composition. The answer is inorganic composition. It's not a characteristic of living thing. Assignment number two. Tell me the full meaning of Mr. Niger D. Miss, you know that acronym, Mr. Niger D. Tell me its full meaning. Because Mr. Niger D encompasses the characteristic of living things. So tell me in the comment section. I'll be waiting. What is the process? By which cells divide to produce new cells. By which it is called cell division. 
by which cells divide to produce new cells a replication b mitosis c meiosis d fertilization of course you know it's simple it's mitosis mitosis is the process by which of cell division so that new cells two new cells can be produced right um assignment number three for you tell me the difference between meiosis and mitosis mitosis is m-i-t-o-s-i-x meiosis m-e-i-o-s-i-x tell me two differences between two of them okay whenever i give assignment like you already know there is a reason also i will be giving you free jam seller I, I feel you are one of the serious members of this channel i'll be giving you free jam syllables and free jam pass question for those of you that are serious so i'll be giving it to you if you watch this particular video from now to the end if you watch this video from now to the end of this video you will qualify to get free jam syllables and free jam pass question not only on biology i'll give you free jam syllables on chemistry physics biology use of english and any of other subjects that we'll be writing in this jam exam you just tell me the subject you will be writing and i will send you syllables past questions on them they are needed for you to settle down and keep preparing okay let's continue what is the main function of the kidneys what is the main function of the kidneys a regulating blood sugar levels b filtering waste from the blood c producing hormones d digesting food the blood kidneys i mean the kidneys their main function is filter is it, it, it should be kidneys are excrete is one of the excretory organs every human being has two kidneys even though some cell one but please it's not your portion and we have been advised to eat right don't drink smoke these things will kill your kidneys rice and liver okay one of the main function of the kidney is to filter waste from the blood kidneys function is basically cleaning cleansing of the blood cleansing of the blood cleansing of the blood they filter every waste from the blood okay are you still here what is the role of chlorophyll in photosynthesis what is the role of chlorophyll you know chlorophyll now inside the cell it is contained in the chloroplast what is the role of chlorophyll in photosynthesis a absorbing carbon dioxide b absorbing sunlight c releasing oxygen d breaking down glucose the function of the chlorophyll is to absorb absorb sunlight you know that photosynthesis occurs in the presence of sunlight is that not true photosynthesis occurs in the presence of sunlight but there should be a pigment chlorophyll is defined as the green coloring pigment in plants in the leaves of plant the green coloring pigment it is the one that gives it the color okay that greenish color in the leaves in the plant is called chlorophyll if you get a leaf and squeeze it in your hand what will you squeeze out you squeeze out liquid uh, liquid that is greenish in color that liquid greenish that greenish pigment is called chlorophyll and its function is absorbing sunlight so that the plant can do what can photosynthesize are you see here with me which of the following is not a type of muscle tissue which of the following is not a type of muscle tissue a skeletal tissue b cardiac tissue c adipose tissue d smooth tissue the answer is what smooth tissue there's not smooth tissue among the muscle tissues okay let's proceed question 27 what is the function of the pancreas in the digestive system i want you to make a research on this because i won't give you the answer but in part 9 we'll continue from question 27 okay what is the function of the pancreas in the digestive system a producing bile b absorbing nutrients c producing digestive enzymes d storing food the pancreas is 
actually the answer to 27 i want you to tell me the answer in the comment section is it producing bile you know that thing called bile is it producing bile or is it absorbing nutrient is it producing digestive exam or is it storing food what i want you to do is guess the answer make your research and tell me the answer to question 27 in the comment section in the next video part 9 we will continue from question 27 answer question 27 then we'll now proceed to the other questions remember that you can ask me to give you the link to all the videos i've done on biology or on physics on chemistry on use of english on the jam novel and all the rest they are so so important you need to sit yourself down and follow them watch them study them prepare yourself in all areas so that whether they throw you the jam question from front from back from left or right you will show them that you are super prepared if you need me to give you free jam syllables and free jam pass question for your preparation what you just need to do are four things number one is compulsory number one is compulsory every member of this channel must follow step number one and that is joining our youtube channel there is a link on this channel you can see the option just click on on join and join our youtube channel is more it's a must and it's very important when you join you can ask me directly i can speak to you one on one you can chat one on one you, i can become your personal jam jam guide until you pass so joining is so so crucial so if you have been seeing the option before and you have been jumping it don't jump again go and join our noble tutorials youtube channel number two is to, for you to like this video when you like this video then share this video click on share share this video here on what on youtube then click on share again copy the link share that link on whatsapp share that link on facebook groups on whatsapp groups on telegram channels on on instagram on twitter share it to your class class uh, whatsapp group your friends whatsapp group anywhere jam candidates are gathered share this link to them then finally subscribe to our youtube channel noble tutorial once you subscribe Come under this video and type i have subscribed so remember the first thing is to join our youtube channel then like share then type subscribe to our youtube channel then type i have subscribed remember very importantly to submit the assignment i gave you submit the assignment i gave you then there's a very crucial video i'm leaving for you on the screen tap on it and watch now